Hey guys, this is Richard from Welsh Tech. Right, this is my next video for you. This is Antec versus Fantex for what the performance is like from going from Fantex case fans on my 280 AIO to Antec RGB fans. So, benchmarks will continue right now. Right then, so the results Antec wins, but by what? Right, one thing Antec and Fantex case fans have got one thing in common is they look cool, yeah, they perform great, but Antec cost more, they're £45 for two fans, they are uh, PWM four pin, so that means you can control the whole speed, Fantex ain't. Uh, Fante the Antec fans have RGB, but that also comes with a lot of extra cables. The Fantex ones, yeah, they run a stock at, I think it's 1200 RPM, that is it. It does not go any further because it's only a 3 pin PWM. So, the clear winner is Antec, but one thing that the Fantex fans win is acoustics. The Antec fans are running at 1700 RPM. They do sound a lot, they are a lot louder, a lot. Yeah, they push more air, but that's because of the RPM. Fantex ones, barely, they're basically silent at 1200 RPM, and that is it. Because they're three pin, can't control them, so they just go full out all the time. So my Antec fans, for this specific test, I had it set at full blast because the Fantex fans will be going full blast. So it had to be a good comparison. It couldn't just be me doing the same speeds because then it's not fair because the Antec fans can push and blow a lot more air than... Sorry, the Antec fans can blow and push a lot more air than the Fantex fans. So... Conclusion is Antec wins, but one thing Fantex has over the Antec is the price as well as acoustics. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to check out next week for my next video. This is Richard from Welsh Tech. I hope you have a brilliant day. Goodbye.